beautiful welcome back to my channel thank you so much for clicking into this video as you can see from the title I'm going to be sharing with you guys my very first ipsy bag now I know you guys just probably watched my unboxing of my boxy charm my very first boxy charm and how excited I was so I figured hey why not so just like with my boxy charm this is going to be a first impressions and so i just bought the basic of both plans so my boxy charm if you didn't see that video i will link it up here for you guys but if you didn't see that video i and if, it, if i don't think that i mentioned i just got the base box so whatever you get for 25 dollars. so i figured i'll get both 25 dollars subscriptions um because you get about five full size items in each one so i figured i'll get 10 one from boxy and one from ipsy and what i might do uh in the future is do a comparison of the items that i got from my boxy charm and things that i got from my ipsy subscription so if that's something that you guys will be interested in seeing let me know down in the description box below before we get started, I would like for you guys to go ahead and hit that subscribe button, become a part of the Genuine Family. Go ahead and also follow me on Instagram. I would love to engage with you guys over there. So let's go ahead and get right on to it. So the first impressions, I really, really like the drawstring bag. This is not what I was expecting, but they did send me an email saying that they were switching up how the bags were going to be coming so maybe it's to be able to fit the full size items because I was thinking I was going to get like a little cosmetic bag at first but the drawstring bag is okay um, this would be good for travel and so the very first thing that I see just like my boxy charm is there is a little booklet in here that also tells you what you received now I'm gonna try to be proactive and see if it's anything that I had that was substitute. I'm probably not gonna be able to tell until after I've gone through everything. So the first thing that I pulled out is the Dutch Dirt Mask by uh, Bloom Effects. And it looks just like this. It says a skin purifying pore purging powerhouse detox purify deeply exfoliate oh they listen when i took my beauty quiz i think that's what they call it y'all don't don't quote me on that but this is really um this is really interesting is this a peel off mask or is this one that you just wash away wear for 20 minutes to help reset refresh and rebalance your skin and make large pores a thing of the past yes they must have been listening to me because I'm always talking about trying to reduce these pores. I'm excited about that. So the next thing that I have in here is the Martian Mattifying Water Gel Toner. <gasps> Y'all, I am so intrigued by these items. Like It seemed like they was listening to my skincare needs, baby. For oily to blemish prone skin. It has Benetonite, Marshmallow, and uh, manuku manuku and this oh if i didn't mention the uh dutch dirt mask retails for 49 dollars this uh water gel toner by uh oh the brand is sunday riley and this is the martian mattifying melting water gel toner this retails for 25 dollars it just says perfect for all skin types and heaven for oilier complexions yes Yes, I might start using this tomorrow because oily. This is, I've never heard of the Martian brand. So if any of you guys have ever used this, let me know what you think about the Martian or Sunday Riley. I don't know why I keep saying Martian, but because it keep it says it right up there. So the next thing is, looks like an eyeshadow palette and it is just in this little bubble wrap. So let's open that up. This is by the brand Shayna B Miami. And it looks like the name of the eyeshadow palette is Miami. Yeah, so this is the Shayna B Miami Mini Miami eyeshadow palette. So, and it looks just like this. 
and then it just slides out just like the Artisto palette that I got in my BoxyCharm. It has a mirror on here so I'm not going to blind you guys. But here are the colors. Just some neutrals. I think I might uh, see if I can go in and change um, my shade colors that I asked for because I think I just only selected neutrals because I probably wasn't going to step out of my comfort zone and try some bold colors but I don't want to keep getting uh, bland colors every month so I think I'm going to go and change my profile to see if that's even possible to change your style quiz but these colors are really nice there are some shimmers there are some uh, shimmer colors at the top and some matte ones at the bottom. So this will probably be really cute or really nice in the summertime. I'm pretty much going to be a one or a two shade type of person until I learn how to do more techniques. Or maybe I may not even do all these other techniques. I might just stick to a one or two shadow uh, eye look. Because you know I'm getting up there in age. I'll be 37 this year. Coming up really really soon in May. So we're going to have to try to figure out what to do. Speaking of my birthday. We're going to have to try to figure out what we're going to do. How we're going to celebrate your girl birthday. Coming up May 30th. Gemini stand up. So yeah. This palette retails for $20. And if you guys have ever heard of Shayna B. Then let me know. Are these colors really pigmented or not? I'm not going to swatch them for you guys, but um, if I decide to use them, you guys will know about it. So the very next thing I have is the, I'm just going to read it from here. It's the Ciate London. Now y'all let me know if I'm uh, mispronouncing that. It's the Ciate London Triple Shot uh, XXL Mascara in Black XXL. And it looks to, comes in a silver packaging just like that. Really pretty. Love the packaging. And it looks just like that. I want to see what the wand looks like. So I'm going to show, show you guys. Okay. Just a, a typical... Just a typical wand. Nothing too fancy. But I'm excited to use that. I typically don't put mascara on when I have my lashes on just because I re-wear my lashes all the time and I don't want to go through the cleaning process. Now what I will do is I'll put a liquid liner on top of my lid. So the very last thing that is in here, it's going to be the Tarte Tardis Double Take Eyeliner in Black. And it looks just like this from Tarte Cosmetics. And let's just open it up. This retails for $24 and I also did not mention, I forgot to mention that the Ciate London uh, Triple Shot Mascara is retails for $22. This Tarte Eyeliner retails for $24. I'm trying to make sure if I didn't miss anything. No, that's it. So I can actually hear something in here. It might be double sided and it is. So. It is, it has a retractable pencil on one side. It just has the retractable pencil on one side of here. And then also has the liquid liner, which I really, really like that on the other side. So that's going to do it for my Ipsy bag for this month, you guys. This is my very first subscription to Ipsy in my very first month getting it. Let me know if you guys have tried Ipsy, if you have any of these products, what you thought of them, if you tried them. If you guys want to see a compar comparison video of my BoxyCharm and my Ipsy bag for the month of May, then let me know. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button before you leave. Become a part of the genuine family. And I will see you guys in my next video. Until then, live your life, sis. Bye.